everyone, I'm Beth, and today I'm going to take you through a 10-minute Arms Express class. So these workouts are pretty quick. You always have the option to do them for a second round if you want, just taking a minute break after we finish our last exercise, and then starting it back up again if you want just a little bit of a longer workout. Otherwise, we're going to go ahead and get started. Today, I'm just using two-pound weights, and we're going to start with our overhead press. So just take it overhead. I want you to think about sliding those shoulder blades down your back as you bring your arms down. Keeping the shoulders down away from your ears. Good, as you do this. You're pulling up from your pelvic floor through your core and the crown of your head. So you're gaining even more height, just making sure that you're not sagging. You're gonna hold this one right here we're gonna flip those arms over. So I call this our scarecrow. We're just gonna flip those arms down and then flip them right back. You wanna keep those wrists right over those elbows. Good. So we're just working on the health of those shoulders, moving them in every direction. You got it. Flip them over and flip them back. Nice job. All right. On our next one, we're gonna hold them up and we're gonna alternate Closing that goalpost and opening it. Close it and open it. So if at any time you feel your shoulders starting to creep up towards your ears, maybe just bring the arms down, take a quick break, and then jump right back into it. We've got 15 more seconds here. And then we're going to take both arms, close and open. You got it. Nice job, you guys. So keep those elbows lifted at shoulder height if you can. One more on each side. And then let's go ahead and close them and open them. I want you to lead with those elbows. Whew, you should be feeling this now. We're gonna take a quick breather after this one. We're gonna bring those arms down and up into our scoops. So that way your shoulders get a quick break. And hopefully we'll then jump right back into it. And we'll be have a little bit more energy. All right, next time you close it. Let's bring them down and then bring them right back up. Good. So as you bring those elbows back, bringing those shoulder blades together, see if you can keep that rib cage closed. So from um, trying to prevent it from splaying open, keep breathing here. Excellent. Next up, we've got our forward bicep curl. We're going to do that in a hammer curl in three, two, and one, hold it right here. We're gonna take those arms out and then bring them right back. Out and in, good. Pull those shoulders back, beautiful. So again, if those shoulders are starting to inch up towards your ears, maybe just bring the arms down a little lower, but keep the elbows away from the body. Good, that isolates that bicep and make sure that we're working that muscle. All right, we've got three, two, one, you're gonna hold it here. You're gonna pulse it up. So those wrists stay right over those elbows. And then remember, try not to let those weights fall backwards. You wanna keep the wrists nice and flat. Good job. We're gonna go into those skull crushers next. So we're gonna take these arms overhead. We're gonna keep those elbows nice and narrow. And we're gonna extend and bend those arms in three, two, one, take those arms up, bend them, and extend them. Good, bend, extend. So here also, you wanna try and drop those shoulders down. So I know this can be a hard one to do to get in the right form. You wanna keep those elbows nice and narrow, facing me, and then extend and bend. We're getting into those triceps. From here, we're gonna open those arms up and out to the side into our hug -a moon in three, two, and one, open them out. Just to that shoulder height, get a slight bend in those elbows and then bring them back together. Good, open and close. You got it. Really nice. We're about halfway through now. So hang in there, stick with it. You can do it, but of course, always take those breaks if you need them. You just wanna make sure that you keep that great form. You've got three, Two, one, we're gonna laterally bicep. So lateral bicep curl in and out. We try to 
Keep those elbows lifted and relaxing those shoulders. Good, all the way in, full contraction, full extension. Beautiful. All right, so next up, we're gonna do some cross punches here. Again, you'll feel a little break in those shoulders. Here we go. We're gonna get the waist involved. Cross punch, cross punch. Nice job. So feel that twist through the waist, a little extra bonus. We get to work that waistline as we do this. Punch it out, pull it back in. Nice. Cross punch, cross punch. We're gonna move this into kick out. So knuckles are gonna to come together and we're gonna kick those hands out in three, two, and one. Knuckles come together, kick it out. Like you're sliding it across a countertop, out and in, squeeze, out, in, out, in. Beautiful. Really nice job. We've got 10 more seconds. Then we're gonna take these arms forward. And we're going to do some little circles here. In three, two, and one. Bring those arms forward, little circles. So we're going to start with our palms facing down, and then we're going to reverse it. Flip those palms over and reverse those circles. Good, 15 more seconds. So I want you to think about pulling those shoulder blades back like you're standing up against a wall and then bring the shoulders down. Three, two, one. You're gonna flip those palms over, reverse those circles. Good, so you're gonna feel this in your pectoral muscles across your chest, but we don't wanna round our shoulders forward. So we wanna pull the chest wide. We've got 10 more seconds, and then we're gonna bring these arms in, and we're gonna reach and pull. So we're gonna pull it in and then reach it out in five, four, three, two, one. Pull it in, reach it out, pull, reach, good. You got it. So you wanna take it out, pull it right back in, try to stop the rocking in the body and just make those arms move. Now, if your shoulders are just killing you, maybe you take it straight out in front, if you've got a little left in the tank, you're gonna take it right where your ceiling and wall meet. Good. In three, two, one. We're gonna take those arms in front. We're gonna crisscross it up. And then right back down. And up. And down. We've got two more minutes to go and we're gonna work those triceps. We're gonna burn them out. And then we'll stretch it out and we'll be done. All right, hold on to it. Last five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna take those arms in nice and tight. We're gonna hinge it over. We're gonna take those arms in front and then pull and pull. Pulling those shoulder blades together. So working those back extensors, also known as our posture muscles, Excellent. Five more seconds, and then we're going to hold those elbows up there and kick it back. Three, two, one. Hold it here. Kick it back. And then, so I'm trying to keep my elbows right up where I put them in space and then extend from there. I have to squeeze those triceps really tight to do so. I want my neck in line with my spine. I want my belly button pulling in, my hips sitting back, weights in my heels. Good, you've got it. All right, you're gonna hold it back there. You're gonna pulse it up. You can do this. Our last move is gonna be to come down onto our mat and we're gonna do some push-ups, okay? Hold on to it. Now pulse it in. Take those arms just a little higher. See if you can come parallel with the floor. In three, two, and one, good, stand it up. We're gonna set those weights down. We're gonna come on down into our push-up position. So if that's on your hands, or excuse me, on your knees or your toes, take those shoulders over their wrists. Come on, here we go. 
push up, push up. Now, if you want to add a shoulder tap in between there, you absolutely can. Let's burn these triceps out. Keep those abs pulling in. Hips are tucked under. Almost there. We've got 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Sit it back. Good. Stretch those arms out. Getting a little counter stretch in our low lumbar as well. So we're stretching it out here. And then sit back on those heels if it's comfortable. And let's take those hands behind us. Pump up that chest. Take those arms up. Whew. Nice job, everyone. All right, let go of those arms. Let's go ahead and stretch one arm across. Bring that shoulder down away from your ear. Big inhale, exhale, maybe look over that shoulder. And then let's do that to the other side. Bring that arm across, look over that shoulder. Big inhale and big exhale. Good, awesome job, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it again. If you want to do a second round, just give yourself about 30 more seconds or so, and then start that second round. I hope you enjoyed it. Please check out my other videos. And if you haven't subscribed, I'd love it if you would. And I hope to see you back here real soon.